White supremacists forced our ancestors to believe in a God who wanted Blacks to be enslaved. But Nat Turner knew a different God, one that encouraged him to fight for freedom. Here's how Christianity guided Nat Turner to liberate his people from slavery on this day. Enslavers largely prevented enslaved people from learning to read and write, but Nat Turner learned by reading the Bible, and he used the skill to do something truly unique. He denied white interpretations of the Bible and interpreted it for himself. For Turner, a deeply religious and intelligent man, the biblical stories he absorbed were messages conveying possibility and hope for Black people. His understanding of Christianity and God through the lens of his Black experience inspired him to follow his visions of enslaved Blacks being free. According to Turner, he was ordained for some great purpose in the hands of the Almighty. His conviction and strong faith led to one of the most notorious rebellions of the century, the Southampton Insurrection. While working in the field one day, Turner said he received a vision from the heavens that told him to fight against the serpent. For the time was fast approaching when the first should be last and the last should be first. Turner gathered 70 other rebels and bravely moved from house to house freeing enslaved blacks. They relieved nearly 60 oppressors of their lives and it took an army to finally stop his soldiers. Though he never was legally free, by following his vision and taking action, Nat Turner undoubtedly freed himself, along with generations of black people to come, from the bonds of slavery. Push Black is a Black-led nonprofit dedicated to raising up Black voices. And as a nonprofit, we rely on small donations from followers like you. With as little as $5 a month, you can help support Black-led media. Click the link in our bio to donate now.